Hello everyone, I am Zhang Yutong from Form 3A. In the last academic year, 2014 to 15, I ranked first in mathematics. Many of you find mathematics is a difficult subject. However, when you know how to deal with maths problems, you will gain satisfaction and you will be interested in it. The problem is, how can you get better results? It is important to find the right way to study. Let me introduce some ways to you. First of all, bring a class workbook or notebook in every lesson. I believe most of the teachers have demanded you to do so. Drop down the main points and some typical questions in it. When you do revision, you can study the class workbook. Also, there are no spaces for you to do the steps in the book. Class workbook is a good option to do. Second, if you want to do better in maths, you need to do many exercises. Just like me, I do many exercises on the basic one to build up my foundation. Practice makes perfect. It is important to practice on the basic one. Many questions are very similar. You just need to use the same way to solve them. Do as much as you can. Then you will be familiar with that type of questions. And you will find it easy when you do more and more. For the difficult one, they are just a combination of using different techniques. So when you can handle the basic one, I think it's not a big problem to deal with the difficult one. Third, find some place quiet when you are doing exercises. The noise will distract you and you can't pay full attention. It's hard for you to think. And when you are stuck in one question or when you can't think of anything, leave the question first. Do other things or just rest for a while. There's no use to continue to think. After clearing your mind, try to use another angle to think. You will think of something that you haven't thought yet. Fourth, feel free to ask any questions. I believe the teachers and the classmates will not mind answering. I think it's very effective to discuss problems with others. More people can think in more different perspectives. You can learn the different ways to solve the problems. I encourage the students with good results to teach the students with problems. You can have better understanding towards the topic. For me, I always help the students with problems. I can check whether I really understand the topic well and at the same time, reinforce my own knowledge. For example, I always learn the special ideas from the others and some better ways to solve the problems. Fifth, when you are studying for the exam, especially in the second term, you may already forget the things you have learned in the first term. Therefore, you need to revise different types of questions in different chapters. Be careful of the questions you have done wrong. The revision will take you a very long time, so try to study earlier. Last but not least, when you are having exams, skip the ones you don't know. Do not waste time on it. Do the one you know first. After that, when you have time, go back to the one you don't know. Read the questions very carefully. Make sure you clearly understand what the question said. Write the steps explicitly. It's not worthy to lose any marks because of careless mistakes. If there are some multiple choice questions, don't leave it blank even you don't know the answers. Guess what? Maybe you'll be right. Who knows? That's all my suggestion. Find a way that suits you. They are not only suitable for mathematics, also for the other subjects. After hearing my advice, I hope everyone can have improvements in maths. Thank you.